If you have a Facebook page, do you really need a Facebook group? In this video, you'll learn the major differences between Facebook groups and Facebook pages so that you can decide whether you need one or both. Let's get started. My name is Caitlin Batcher, and over the last two years, I've used my Facebook group as a tool to build a multiple six-figure business, and now I help others do the same. Since Facebook groups have become more and more popular, many entrepreneurs are left wondering, isn't my Facebook business page enough? And the answer is maybe. I've identified five important differences between Facebook groups and Facebook pages, and I'm gonna share them with you today. Number one. You need a Facebook page in order to run ads. If paid advertising is a part of your marketing strategy, you need a Facebook page. Facebook will not let you run ads without a business page. Number two, Facebook groups provide you with an opportunity for a deeper connection with your audience. Now your business Facebook page is available for all to see. That means people probably aren't willing to bear their soul in the comments. Your audience is more willing to open up about their struggles inside of a private Facebook group. Once you understand their struggles, you can serve them better. Number three, Facebook groups provide better visibility. Facebook algorithms decrease the organic reach on your business page by as much as 98%. What that means is that if you have 100 people like your business page, 98 of them are not going to see your content. In a Facebook group, everyone gets to see your posts. This increases your opportunity to connect with people who need your help. Number four, you can grow your email list a whole lot faster with Facebook groups than you can with your business page. Facebook groups are insanely effective at growing your email list. My own Facebook group adds hundreds of people to my email list every single week. That's with zero paid advertising. That's because the people in my group are connected and engaged with me in a way that just doesn't happen on my business page. So when I do share a lead magnet inside of my Facebook group, people are much more likely to opt in for it. Number five, Facebook groups are much more profitable than Facebook pages. Facebook groups create this perfect storm of connection, trust, and visibility that you just can't find anywhere else. Have you noticed that even top Instagram and YouTube marketers have started their own Facebook groups? Even they know that Facebook groups are the best way to generate buzz and excitement for their businesses. Now you have a better understanding of the differences between Facebook pages and Facebook groups. And you might be thinking to yourself, well, I guess I won't even bother with the Facebook page. Don't do that. Potential customers and even group members still want to connect with you on your Facebook business page. So my advice is to do both, but devote most of your attention to your Facebook group. If you want to learn more about setting your Facebook group up for success, make sure to download my free ultimate checklist for Facebook group hosts. This free checklist will outline the process of creating your own profitable Facebook group. One more thing, if you want to hang out with me and thousands of other entrepreneurs just like you, make sure that you join my free Facebook group. You can find the link in the description below. Thank you so much for watching today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you hit subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and leave me a comment. See you soon.